What's up everyone, this is Cybernight CCG, and today we're opening up a Card Fat Vanguard Mystical Magus uh, box for you guys. It's one of the, you know, like character packs, I guess what they call it. I know there's like a special thing for them. Uh, but yeah, they're actually really cool. Mizaki, which is uh, one of my favorite characters from, I think I'm saying her name right, one of my favorite characters from Card Fat Vanguard. I always question myself on that kind of stuff. I'm not the best at that, at uh, saying people's names and stuff. I can kind of show you guys the box and everything. You're... You can see, like, it has double rares, all that kind of cool stuff. I think it's Oracle Think Tanks as well. Um, I'm kind of behind on the show, so I guess she went back to them. I thought she was using, what was it, Angel Feathers? I think that was the last time I watched, and she had those. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to give any spoilers where I left off on this thing, because I don't want someone to be behind, and then I spoiled it for them. So, uh, I still need to catch up on that, though. I need to do that and, and uh, watch. I'm still a little bit behind on Buddy Fire, and I'll be caught up, I think, on everything. Anyway, I got this from Big Game Collectibles, so be sure to check them out, of course. Link in the description, that's where I got the box. And uh, where I'll be getting future stuff, you know, buddy fights, where I've done openings from that, and uh, card fighting stuff. Also, I need to get a, a bigger card fight mat. I need to make, like, a custom one. What do you guys think I should have, like, in the background? You know, just tell me what you guys think on that. I was thinking of doing something, I don't know, something cool, because I am going with the gold paladins. I'll go ahead and start opening this while I'm yapping. <laughs> I am uh, going with gold paladins for the main deck that I'm using, the special duke version, because I, I like that one, and uh, it's pretty well budget. I mean, I might make some other budget, like that profiles in the future, and we'll have the special duke, the profile, I think this week as well. But, uh, yeah, tell me what you guys think. Should I have, like, special duke dragon, and maybe something else in the background, or give me some ideas. I know what you guys think on that. Make it look really cool. If anyone's good at design and playmats too, uh, send me a message. <laughs> I could use the help. You know, we have a Dimension Police card. I guess it's like a promo you get. I don't know if you get the same one in each one or not. It looks really cool. Dimension Robo, uh, Di Barrett? Di Barrett? Oh, it looks cool. Transformers. <laughs> That's what I I've been tempted to build those, but I think they're kind of expensive. Get one at a time and uh, see what we get. I want to get the main card. I don't know what it's called, but it just looks really cool in the background. I'm only going to name off, of course, the rares, double rares, and that kind of stuff. So hopefully you guys can tell on the other cards. And I think we started off well. What is this? this is, okay, it's a regular rare. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was a higher rarity because, wait, look, Little Witch Lulu. So yeah, I thought it was high rarity because how sparkly it was on there. Still really cool looking, though, on the holographic. There's, like, advertisement for uh, Y Schwartz. Uh, See, Sword Art Online Volume 2, the card game. I think we're going to do an opening of that as well, if you guys like to see why Schwartz uh, openings in the future. Sword Art, I think, is the only why Schwartz uh, anime that I've I've watched, like, <laughs> of all the stuff they printed on that. I don't, of course, I don't watch a whole lot of anime. Not as much as I used to lately. I've been busy, but we're going to have to fix that. All right, we have uh, Promised Daughter. Another rare. Pretty cool looking. I like the artwork of a lot of these. Yeah, I've been behind on like all kinds of anime stuff. I need to catch up on it. I even have a subscription like to Crunchyroll. I need to I need to use that instead of just paying for that for nothing, right? Use that more than I do. I should watch like everything they have. Right here. Oh man, this looks awesome. What is this? A triple rare. Battle Sister Parfait? Parfait? I guess how you say that? Yeah. I'll say I'm saying that, right? Oh man, that looks freaking awesome. I like how they're like nuns, but they have like guns and everything. What she has? She has swords. Yeah, she has like swords. That's freaking awesome looking. Make a, a, a dangerous nun. <laughs> That's a sentence you wouldn't think he would ever say in life. <laughs> That's pretty cool though. Triple rare. I assume it's a pretty good one. I mean, it is triple rare. I'm tempted to build these, but I'm sure it's not too easy. Let's see, uh, imperial daughter. I don't know if these are budget Ridley or not, though. Tell me in the comments if uh, Oracle Think Tanks are, are expensive or not. Because, you know, I'd like to build something a little different. I've used Special Duke, actually, for quite a while. I just never did a video about it. Here we go, another, let's see, this is a double rare. Battle Sister uh, uh, Cocolet? Cocolet, I guess how you say that? Looks pretty cool as well. She has, like, a scythe? Yeah, it's a scythe. Looks really neat. I wish they wouldn't put these advertisements in each pack. Oh, let's put our... There. Things that aren't rares <laughs> next to each other like that. Stay organized. There we go. It's like Pokemon with the code cards. I always have to separate them. Alright, we have another rare, which is Oracle Agent Royce. Looks pretty cool. 
am though. I really like the the rare holographic they got going. It's freaking awesome looking. They do a good job with that. All right, looks like we have something good. We have a double rare again. Yes, a stellar uh, magus, which looks really neat as well. If anyone has like a deck list on Oracle Think Tank as well, uh, send me a message. Give me some ideas. I'm still a little bit of a noob on some of these card fight stuff. Of course, there's so many clans. I don't know how I would be able to keep track of it all anyway. But I might try to build these, actually. More and more I'm thinking about it. See, we have a Crescent uh, Magus as well. Not sure what I'm guaranteed to get out of this, so let's see. Do we get another triple rare, or is, that, is it only one? I forgot. Evil Eye Princess, uh, Uriel? Uriel, I think is how you say that? Regular rare. She doesn't look very nice. <laughs> Looks kind of evil. Alright, let's see. More Battle Sisters. Those look really cool. Then we have another uh, Crescent Magus. There, there we go. Right, how many more we got? We have like three or four. Four, I think, more. Come on, let's see if we can get us a uh, few more double rares, triple rares, anything we can get. See, we... <laughs> I like the artwork of that one. It is uh, a regular rare, and it's Battle Sister Macaroon, Macaroon, I guess. And, uh... Yeah, <laughs> just it's like it's too machine guns just going crazy. Reminds me of like Jinx from League of Legends in a way, you know how she acts crazy shooting like machine guns. <laughs> it just kind of looks funny. Not a person you want to see. That's for dang sure. They're crazy and they're turning into Swiss cheese. Oh, perfect guard. Very cool. Uh, uh, Tetra Magus, and that is a double rare. Well, I'll definitely, if I do build this, I'm not sure yet. I definitely need that. Probably not too hard to get to since it is in this. Maybe perfect cards will be a little easier to get instead of like in a main set. I don't know. Maybe that won't be too expensive if I do build it. Another uh, rare. We have Little Witch Lulu. And, oh, okay, we do have two more. Okay, I thought we were at our last one. Good. Let's see if we can get something else then. Guess another perfect card. I don't know if it's possible to get two of the same double rare or anything like that in these, but uh, let's see if we can. We have another rare, which is uh, another Magus card. Looks really cool. Looks like the Good Witch from Wizard of Oz. Isn't it? It's the North Witch? I don't know. <laughs> I've never actually seen Wizard of Oz. Fun fact. I've only seen like bits and pieces. Probably a good thing. The flying monkeys look a little scary, even by today's standards. <laughs> And then we have uh, another rare, which is Evil Eye Princess, Uriel. So yeah, I guess you only do get one double or triple rare. I think I thought you did, but you know, just wanted to see. Maybe we could break some kind of record and get a couple. But yeah, we got uh, three double rares and then one uh, triple rare. Not bad. I think we did really well. Especially, I know I didn't get the main one, but I kind of like this one better. She looks really awesome. I like how she has the swords and everything. It looks really cool. Even if I don't build this, I might want to keep this card from my collection. It just looks really neat. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed this opening course. Thank you for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Tell me if uh, if this is pretty well budget to build, or uh, if there's what other decks out there are pretty well, you know, pretty cheap to make and that are still strong and, and fun to use. Of course, I've been even thinking of Nova Grapplers just because they look like Gundams, and of course, who doesn't like Gundams? I mean, there's something wrong with you if you don't. And uh, yeah, just so much you guys think on that. Thank you for watching, and uh, we'll have a trade binder and all that stuff very soon on my main channel. So, the, if you haven't been subscribed, which hopefully you are, subscribe to my main channel, of course. We do a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff. If you're, you know, if you're only on this channel, go over there. I do a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff, and of course, I'm going to have my trade binder and all from all my channels. That includes like the Pokemon Binder, the, you know, Card Fight, and all that kind of stuff, Yu-Gi-Oh! All are going to be on that channel. That way I can keep track of it a lot easier. So if you want to trade and stuff in the future from stuff I get on this channel, be sure to check out that video. I'll have like a link to it or something in the future. I'll make like a video over here too to kind of tell you guys. But yeah, of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya.